Do you know the difference between a site engineer and a project engineer? What is a site engineer? Where does he work at? Where does a project engineer work at? They sound like a, almost the same type of job, but yet they're different. What are those differences? In this video, we're going to cover those differences. All right, now we have two different types of engineers, a site engineer and a project engineer. Which is which? What does a site engineer do and what does a project engineer do? Well, let's take a look at one at a time. Site engineers are usually, as the words say, on the site. They have one project that they're working on, a site, a construction site. The site engineer is very concerned on that particular project, making sure that it's built on time and on budget. That's all he's concerned with all day long. He is very technical and he's also involved with the technical aspects of that project. He's not the manager, the site manager, but he is the site engineer. He's going to be the liaison between those who work on the site, the various subcontractors, and the manager, the site manager, and the client, and anyone else that would be involved with this project. So he's the in-between guy. All the technical information comes to him. He will solve most of all those technical problems. If the design plans are not clear, then he will probably issue what's called an RFI, Request for Information, from that design professional to get a better understanding of exactly what he wanted. Then once he has that answer, he can then move it on into the field and get it built according to plans. Now let's take a look at what a project engineer is. A project engineer usually works an office, okay? <laughs> and they will have multiple projects that they will be assigned to them. Not unheard of, but maybe 10, 20 different projects that they're going to be responsible for that they re they are watching over every single day. Also, on a project engineer, they will have a design team. The design team are usually the individuals who are actually working on the design. You have your designers, your CAD operators, uh, you may have uh, technicians or what have you on the same design team but the project engineer is overseeing them to make sure that the technical aspects of the project are being designed correctly and are meeting the standards of not only the company, but also the various entities that would be reviewing that project. I know you've gotten value out of this video, so please go down below right there and subscribe to our channel. Also go a little bit further over over there and you'll see a bell. Make sure you hit that bell and Every time we bring up a new video, you'll be notified. Also, we'd like for you to hit that like button. The like button, when you hit it, lets us know that we're doing a pretty good job of making our videos and that you want to see more of our videos. And so we'll keep on posting. Now, also project engineers are also liaisons between the design team, the project manager, the client, and upper management, and anyone else. So just like the site engineer, there, they're very similar. But unlike the site engineer, they will have multiple projects, whereas the site engineer will have one project that he's watching all day long. Project engineers are usually not too much into the safety and health of the individuals because they're not working in a, a dangerous environment, whereas the site engineer is very concerned about the safety and health of all those who are on the construction site. Also, a site engineer will usually have at least a bachelor's of science in engineering and a project engineer will probably at least have a bachelor of science in engineering. Some may even have a master's in engineering also. So as far as education levels, both the site engineer and the project engineer are very similar. So those are some of the differences between a site engineer versus a project engineer. Now, which job is more uh, rewarding? Well, that depends on you. For a site engineer, they work on a site. They see the project from the initially raw, raw ground. 
to all the way to a completed project with a building or some sort of structure built at the job site. Very rewarding. It's something you can tell your family and, and friends forever that that project right there, I helped build that. It was my work that got it up. A project engineer, on the other hand, is uh, will work on multiple projects. They will have uh, basically a set of plans at the end that is issued out to the public for them to build. So a contractor will come along later and pick up those plans and start building. Even there, they get to go down the street with their family and friends and say, that project, that project, that project over there. Uh, all of those, I did the drawings for those. My team did that. It's up to you which one is better for you. Both have their very big pluses and they also have their negatives. So which one did you choose? Would you think to be a site engineer or to be a project engineer? Two totally different career paths, but both are just as rewarding as the other one. If you want to know more about engineering and the management of engineering and the business of engineering, please go over and subscribe to our channel. Also, go further over there and you'll see two other videos that we recommend you watch next. These videos are on the engineering and management of an engineering business. Till the next time, keep on growing your engineering skills and increasing those management skills because we'll see you on the next video.